is no we are not ready <laughs> how come is it that every time i come to do a live stream there's like some crazy update that needs to go through oh man right on right on we're coming we're coming out the gates strong tyler Tyler Grill with this sub. Thank you. Appreciate it, Tyler. Well, who's all in the chat while we wait for this loading screen to finally load? Fat Seagull, Just Drift, Gerald Bates, James, Happy Man, JP Customs, Costumes, Micah Young, uh, blah, 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 Gerald, Country Boys, uh, Fish Enthusiast, Suspect, I Love the Outdoors, Kilo Knights in the House, Micah Young, do, 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 do. It's Storm. 100 people watching. Come on. Come on. C come on. They all know. They all know that we're just stuck on a loading screen. Nothing to watch. Nothing to watch. That's what they're saying. The other 60 people waiting. I'm gonna apply. Apply. Lotion. This time of the year, everything's drying out. Stay moisturized. Get the chapstick. Get the lotion. Don't let your skin start to crack. All right. Top notch. Top water kayak cup. Thank you, Fishing Planet. Sounds like we did a poll today. Sounds like everyone's looking forward to doing some more Weeping Willows fishing. So that's what we're going to do today. Get the old carp rods together. Get the old uh, new Gigantica mix from um oh golly blinking blinking on his name at the moment but we're going to be using the gigantic mix as well 
Um, and then we are going to head on out. Head on out. This is what my friends list looks like every single time I open up the game. I have like 30 to 50 new friend requests. Okay. Top notch. Let's see what we got here. 14 knot hooks. That's looking good. Micah Young. Micah Young with this subscribe. You are already subscribed. You crazy, crazy guy. Excuse me. Goodness gracious. Okay, so we got the carp thing. We got to throw on a 14 knot hook. I'm almost there, you guys. We're almost there. We uh, split it up last time. We did what? We did citrus on one, plum on the other, and then what? Strawberry? I think. Make sure we have all the stuff we need. We're running out of plum and strawberry, but maybe, maybe we'll get a few. I don't know. Probably not that big of a deal, but might as well play it safe. Oh, the, the font is different now. Strawberry boilies. Now, when we buy... Is that... Did we do it right? Oh, shoot. We bought shellfish. I don't need shellfish. I need plum. Dang it, why didn't anyone tell me? Then <laughs> I just skipped that. Plum, here we go. Got it. That work? It did work, okay, we're good. We're golden, everybody. Next thing we need to do is make sure that we have enough of this stuff, because we used quite a bit of it last time, and then we about ran out because of all the freaking glitches that were going on last time. So we need to make sure we have plenty of catfish destroyer, which it looks like we do. We do need to get at least, let's do three more carp rival, two more big riverine bremer. And then we'll be good there as well. No regrets. Two years and no regrets for becoming a member. Oh, Gerald Bates. Thank you, thank you. What's your smallest fish? I don't know. Something that I didn't even mean to hook, most likely. What about everyone else? What's everyone else's smallest fish they've ever, ever caught? Huh? Mine is probably something that I didn't mean to catch. It just kind of was on the hook as I was reeling it in, you know? Something small, like a little minnow or something like that. Do we have enough of this stuff? Looks like we do. Do we have enough of this stuff, though? That's the next question. Looks like we need more of that as well. I tell you what, the big 100-pound fish stuff. Hemp corn and oil cake. That is... You go through it, that's for sure. All right. We should be good now. We got plenty of that. We got plenty of this. Yeah, hopefully plenty of this. I'm hopeful. Yeah, we should be good. All right, to Weeping Willows we go. That's the United States. Here we go, Weeping Willows. Buy a license for one. And head off. Boom. We're good. Suspect fish enthusiast crazy frazy. Been a while. Right row. Oh, but Taven States Dark Exile. That's back a little bit. So I haven't been watching live. I've been so caught up in work. Hey, I understand. I understand what it's like to be caught up in work. That's for sure. That is for sure. Blunt nosed minnow. Diddy. Are, is this uh is this us fleshing out Nightbot's background? Yet again? Uh, if anyone wasn't there last time, we, uh, during the last live stream, we were kind of trying to think up what, uh, Nightbot's backstory, backstory would be. Thirty-three pounder, thirty-three pounder. I don't know how to get this, um, I thought I turned it off, but maybe I turned it on. Did I turn it off or turn it on? 
I don't know what I did. Okay, here we go. We got to mix our Gigantica mix now. So here we go. Wait a second. Why don't we actually get to the day that we need to get on first? How about that? That way our mix doesn't go bad. That's thinking outside the box. <laughs> okay, here we go. We actually did it. We're actually doing it correctly this time. Right. Oh, no. Why'd you even ask me? I didn't even want that. All I wanted to do was exit out of that thing. This is stupid. Freaking crap. Go back home. Come on. H Weeping Willows is our home. You're in the Amazon maze. You're in the Amazon maze, huh? Caught a minnow on accident? Yeah. Keep on catching young common only level 29. Do you think I should harp fish at this level? Probably not. I wouldn't think so. But you can do whatever you want, man. It's an RPG. You can you can do what do what you want. You're new, how you doing, Apton Miller? Fantastic. Love to see it. Alright, let's try this again. Shall we? Okay. Boom shakalaka. What? What is going on? <laughs> so we're supposed to hit ex why why just Ah Just let us stay. Just let us stay. I don't remember this question popping up like this. It's part of the new update. This has never happened to me before. We need to hit extend stay evidently, but I don't remember it ever popping up so late like that. It's, it's taking me off guard. Did you misclick again? I guess so. I didn't hit the actual go home button this time. I just hit the escape button and it, it clicked me out. All right, let's try this again before we even do anything else. Extend stay. Now, if we go to here, extend stay. Why wouldn't you just assume that I want to extend the stay? I'm, I'm already here. Good golly. Okay. Finally, we are here. Let's mix this together. <laughs> Good God. How's your day? British animation do quite well. Thanks for asking, man. Thanks for asking. Ooh, we're banging on all cylinders now. Here we go. Wowie zowie. We are, we are going. Finally fishing. Not really. But we're doing stuff to go fishing. So that's something. One more time. King Wolf's new. Shane, how's it going? Jim? Can you give me some tips on how to catch a gold or diamond in the angler for mission? For mission I have been trying for over a month now and everything I try doesn't work. I tell you what, the uh, getting a gold or diamond in the angler is a combination of using uh, the right hook size and being in the right location. So as long as you have a hook that's in the right size for a gold or diamond, um, then it's all about just finding the right location, you know? And if you don't know about the hook size chart um, that they have like on their Discord and stuff like that, I would go and check that out because that will definitely help you out. It's honestly, until you get better at the game and uh, put in the hours, the hook size chart while playing the, uh, you know, Call of the Wild the Angler is, is nearly like required to use while you play. I usually keep it up on another screen, even during the live streams, I keep it up on another screen um, just so that, you know, I can I can see what size of hooks I need to go after a certain size of uh, fish. <laughs> Your first monster fish was a tr Tyranno Trout. Very nice. Very nice. Just seeing you at Weaving Willows. Hey, right on. Do you know how long till the update for the map? We said it in the video, don't you know? Don't you remember in the video? 
I hate repeating myself. I'm not. I'm not a record. I'm not a. I'm not a broken record that just repeats it over and over again. We gave the timeline in the video. If you didn't see it, didn't hear it, go check it out again. It's like a textbook. It's like a school textbook. If you don't remember it, go back and read the chapter. Have you been fishing in real life? Because I caught a few tenches. You caught a few tenches. I'm jealous. When I was in the UK for just a, a week or so, I was only fishing like two of the two of the days I was there. But uh, I, I wish I could have crossed a tench off the list. Unfortunately, I did not. But uh, that's that's awesome. I haven't been fishing since I was in Taiwan. So it's been it's been a bit, been a bit. Gold we'll diamond before, but once I hit the mission, I haven't caught one since. Oh man, I uh, I've definitely been in the situation where it feels like that for sure. But um, yeah. Hopefully you get another one. Hopefully you get another one soon. Sometimes it just kind of it sucks that you also can't change the time in that game. I think we're gonna go ahead and just go with it. So let's go ahead and try this out. If we don't get any big ones over 70 pounds, maybe then uh, we'll throw out more next time. I don't like that toss. I don't like that cast. Let's try that again. There's the that's it. That's the money. All right, throwing out the plum. Got options. We got options, whatever they're uh, whatever they're just, you know, really hungry for. That's what we're gonna throw out there. Find out if they're hungry for the strawberry, the citrus, or the plum. That's what we're gonna find out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What was this recent update for? You know, there was a lot of stuff that honestly, I think, was it about tournaments or something like that? There was a lot of stuff that it talked about. But like none of it really like applied to the stuff that I do in the game. So I honestly didn't commit it to memory. Uh, the one thing that I remembered was that they added a slider bar to the bait that you buy from the store. So if you ever like, you know, the large minnows are sold in like packs of five or ten or whatever. If you, you'd have to buy, you know, you have to click and then click yes and click again and click yes and click again and click yes to buy like a hundred of them you know now you can just click on it once slide the slider over to a hundred or whatever and um and then boom you got them you got them all that you want i think yeah they i mean you're gonna have to do some math i guess if they get sold in fives then you'll have to buy 20 of them so where is the best map to farming fish depends on the level nightbot was there when the berlin wall was taken down he was there don't you know don't you know anything about nightbot he was there i'm not really sure my uh my music site that i usually use uh you know get music stuff or play the music from it's all messed up now it's not like it usually is. And so I'm like really thrown off. I used to be able to simply go in, find a song that I liked and hit similar tracks. And then it would like bring up a playlist of like 40 songs, just like that first one. And that's what we would listen to during our live streams. However, they recently changed it so that it only pops up five songs which doesn't do us very good if I'm trying to do a live stream for two hours. Five songs at three minutes a piece is not gonna cut it. <laughs> so it's just, it's just, it's just, yeah. So does the size of the fish increase with the amount of times you throw out the spot? Evidently, that's what they say. Oh, there's our first take. There's our first take. Looks like either a leather or a mirror. But evidently, if you throw out a good amount of spot, the size of the fish goes up is the idea. You throw out a bunch of it. Make a ginormous pile under there. I mean, this guy is a decent football, that's for sure. He's a mirror, which is cool. Definitely going to be our first uh, unicorn. 
how big of a unicorn is the question he is the mirror so this is the potential hundred pounder or at least one of them but sorry if it feels like the camera is going I like to I like to pull at the same time it makes it feel more realistic get in there mr. mirror there we go hey 74 pounds so we did throw down enough stuff that's pretty cool 74 pound mirror unfortunately not the big the big hundred pounder we were hoping for looks like we might have a grassy on now I'm not getting a very good look at it it could be a common that's a grassy good deal let's go let's go bass walleye is Tiber River a good place to go? You know, that is like the one place I never went to in my first playthrough. And I still haven't been there in the second playthrough either, so. How am I today? I'm doing quite well, King Wolf. Thanks for asking. How about yourself? Doing okay? All right, you. Get in the net. There we go. Nice. Kicking it off. Kicking it off, baby. We're going to see a lot of these unicorns, so I'm going to cut it short. But that's uh, sweet. 62-pound grassy there. It would be interesting if certain carp like to go for, like, certain flavors, you know? That would be interesting. 100-pound carp on my birthday. I, that would be great, Muffin Man. I, I hope we do get the 100 pound carp on your birthday. Like the stream, y'all. Like the stream. With understanding spotting, hey, right on, man. Glad to hear it. Now, this might be a common. That's what I'm gonna guess. Not wide enough to be a ghost, so I'm gonna go with the common. Muffin the man with the don't know. Thank you, thank you. Night, Nightbot's favorite drink is WD-40. Now that's a funny one. Creative, creative. Come on. Get in there. There we go. I tell you what, when I'm carp fishing, I'm telling you, it's just, it's just gonna be unicorn after unicorn. Um, when I'm carp fishing in Weeping Willows, the net is really fun. I really enjoy the net. It brings back memories of carp fishing in real life, having the net there, because you have to net carp. You're just so big. Um, so yeah, love the net. It's my favorite part. It's one of my favorite things is finding, getting it close enough to get into the net. <clears throat> You'll get a hundred pounder one of these days. I know, I know. One of these days did some fishing by himself before he got his new job it, he has no time to do any fishing nowadays is that what you're saying mr wisegrass get the hunter yo what's up ferno what's going on type of river is fun but not the best for grinding at low levels yeah do you accept for request on fishing planet we used to have a rule um that it was i think it was 60 now it might be 65 i can't recall but uh, I, I've asked um, Andrew a couple of times what they raise the cap to on the friends list, because if it's raised to like a thousand or something like that, I'll start uh, accepting, you know, I'll lower that level requirement down and just start accepting friend requests. Um, but I don't know what it is. So I'm like afraid any moment I'm going to run out of friends or, you know, f friend slots or something like that. And then I'll have to go back to deleting names. So I, I'm just, I'm being sparing with the uh, friends that I've been accepting. Relaxing and fishing now. What a great day. Hey, right on. River Nelson. What's your favorite map? Ooh, hard, hard to say. I think one of my favorite maps, at least, the first one that comes to mind is Blue, Blue Crab. No, not for any particular reason, uh, like leveling wise or anything. It's just, it's just a fun, 
so many different fish to go after there. Weaving Willows is close. Uh, Congo is fun too. Amazonian Maze is cool too. Um, yeah, those, those are kind of the first ones that come to mind. I don't know if I have like an overall favorite though. He got too rusty to... F oh. Is that right? Happy man's out. See you later, man. See you later, alligator. Colton Vlogs, how's it going? First time in your life. Well, right on. Glad you made it. We've, uh, what have we got so far? Grass carp, common carp, mirror carp. We're missing a leather and a ghost. It's all we need from this spot. Then we might move somewhere else and put the spot out some more. Just have to see, I guess. Blue Crab, I would have to agree. You can get into almost everything on that map. What did you get again? We, we got the grass, the common, and the mirror. But, uh, but yeah, for sure. Blue Crab's a good one. It's a good one. It is a little slow, though. Goodness gracious. I was just kind of curious what was hanging down below the marker there. Just a big weight or something. Just jump in the water and tackle the... Uh, you know, at some at some point, it makes you want to, right? What do we got here? Small guy. A small guy. Get in there. <laughs> I tried to drop him in. Trophy leather. Little, little trophy. For this next one, I'm kind of curious. I kind of want to go back to the uh, the old one. Sorry, my brother's texting me. Um, kind of curious to go back to the old mix, but spot out a lot of it. Maybe we can spawn a big one doing that. I don't know. We'll have to see. I bought size fishing chair was Russian fishing in real life. Oh, oh, oh. First time in a live, it's 2 a.m. for you. Musty McDonald's hairline. My goodness gracious. This wasn't a great. It wasn't a great. It wasn't a great location, I guess. I'm not sure. Like as far as uh, casting out, let's see. Let's cast out the rest of what we got and then we'll move on to the next day and we'll change. I hope, I think I have everything we need to do the other one. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Saw the clip too late. Darn it all. There we go. Are you going to get early access to the ocean map? I don't know. You know, that's a darn thing. I asked him that during the interview to see, because I was curious myself and I thought maybe if we asked him during the interview, then, you know, he might, he might tell me. Uh, unfortunately, he said that uh, basically when they do like the uh the early access for for people or like the beta and all that sort of stuff um you know it's just more time so basically it was kind of like you know would you all like to get it uh by january or would you like to get it by february but i get beta or early access for a week <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, like it was going to be more work for them 
to put out early access. So I'm not going to pressure them. To, you know, that means more waiting for you all. Um, I'm, I'm just as happy getting it um, at the same time as everyone else. Someone usually gifts the DLC to me anyway, so I, I'll still get to play it on day one. So it, it'll all it'll all be fine. So confused right now. Oh. Oh, a Christmas song, eh? Oh, your fishing plan's taking a long... Arts took a long time to load as well, Jesse. So don't feel bad about that. I think it's just with the update and everything, it's just taking a little bit. You finished eel farming, made it to the Congo, happens to grab the number two eel spot on the leaderboard. Very nice, Dark Exile. That's awesome. But everyone needs to like the video before I get back. <laughs> there you go. That's a good challenge. 94 viewers. Obviously, there should be 94 likes there. Come on. Come on. What can I do? Oh. Some people were waiting for me to take a drink. They said, you know, it's like a bingo game for some people. They're just waiting there to gift a like if I do something. You know, and they have their little card here waiting for me to do one of the things they have on the checklist. So I know it. I know it. Ew, ad. Yeah, YouTube has really gotten. I don't know if you've noticed the whole like new skip ad thing that they had, but they told us like content creators about this uh, earlier on, you know, weeks ago or whatever. And I mentioned it to everyone in the community page how they were going to start putting out more ads and more unskippable ads and everything like that. Even when it comes to the live stream, like I don't get a choice on whether the live stream shows you skippable ads or unskippable ads. It just, it just does that automatically. And I don't know how to do anything about it. So it's, um, the ad game on YouTube is, has gotten interesting. That's for sure. Bingo. I knew it. I knew it. Some people were waiting for me to switch to another location before getting a like, so you know I just did that. So I'm I'm looking forward to a few more uh few more likes. You know. I'm still I'm still adventuring. I'm still come up come, thinking about what everyone else is looking for. Where some people were wondering when I would hide behind a tree so that the carp can't see me. Little sneaky, sneaky, sneaky loo thing I do sometimes. I don't think I've ever done that. <laughs> but it almost worked. We almost got a bite. Oh my god, this whole uh, music situation is driving me crazy. It did work! We got him! It's a ghost! We were missing a ghost, and now we got him. Heck yeah, boy. Heck yeah, boy. He's, he's, he's coming up. We got you. We got you. Slowly but surely. An obvious unicorn. The ghosts don't get very big, but they, uh, you know, still fun to catch. Still fun to cross off all five. You know what I mean? Still looking forward to the leather. I do believe the leather is the second carp that can get to over 100 pounds. So the mirror and the leather are two chances, really. Get in here, ghosty. Got him. Nice. Boogity, 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 boo. So, heck yeah, man. Got him, got him. Where is my prize? Just started and what bait should I use for catfish? It, you know, honestly depends on the, the, the location that you're fishing. Uh, baits can change by location. Uh, it's at a certain point in the game, large minnows and shine, like large minnows and shiners will pretty much get you through the entire game. <laughs> um, but for catfish, I mean, you've got, you've got lots of options. It's just a really spunky trophy. 
trophy ghost here. I'm trying to figure out what the heck's going on. Cause we just caught a unique ghost. Can't catch a second one. Yeah, a little trophy. Two ghosts in a row. What are the chances? Um, but yeah, I mean, catfish, dog food, cut bait. Um, you know, there's all sorts of bait you can use for catfish, honestly. But you can honestly always go in here as well. Go to fish species and, you know, look up the fish that you're going for. And then you can just see the preferred baits that they like. You know, uh, easy way of going about seeing what the fish like to go for. Stella, how's it going? You're new here, Alpha Omega, right on. Muffin Man, what's your PB carp at the moment? Oh golly, what was it? It was over 80, wasn't it? How do I how do I see this thing? Where are you? There we go. Big carp, where are you? Besides the carp colossus, of course. Here we go. 89 pounds. Just shy of 90. We got with this Gigantica mix, so it's working. I mean, it's not bad anyway. Was the ghost on the pl Oh man, I don't know. Does it show us? Oh, here we go. The ghost was on the plum. The unique one anyway. The trophy one was on the strawberry. If I was interested in that, I would uh, I would actually pay attention to that and see if it continues to be that way. Oh. Uh, nearly level 65 awake and 68 of Amazon place. What would you recommend to level up the fastest? You're you're on your own, man. After EESS, you're on your own. You graduated. You're moving on. Some people swear by the electric eel. Um, I would stretch that a little bit and say, uh, uh, I guess you can't even do because you're you're before the uh, you're before the electric eel, aren't you? <sighs> Hard to say, man. Hard to say. Probably the two catfish got to be the gilded and the red tail. Go to Marone River and farm the gilded and the red tail, I guess. I'm not really sure what else, man. Fish the knights. Fish the knights for the gilded and the red tails. What's the best way to level up? By watching the BZ Hub beginner series 2 videos and doing what they say in the video. Heck yeah. Biggest catfish caught in the game or in real life? What are we talking about? Do you remember me? I just wanted to see how close you was to 100. I know, we're not close. Get in here, come. Just, just unis after unis, man. Unis after unis. We'll give this spot a few more minutes, but I think we need to uh, go to another day and try try the mix again. Might do some justice. That's that's what we're that's what we're trying right now. What do you what do you think we've been using, Dark Exile? You were living under a rock? Goodness gracious. Both. Oh Honestly, I don't know like my biggest channel catfish. We didn't even weigh and I haven't caught a big flathead or a blue cat um, So really that's about it for now and honestly, I'll probably catch some catfish in the Amazon before uh, Before I get a big one here in the States, which is sad, but you know that it, that's that's a story for another time and then um in the game i don't even know don't even know what we got here i eva 90 273 pounds pretty big and pretty big and cool fish there we go all right if this is a little fish we're moving on pretty sure it is we just lose it what the freak was that about that's it we're leaving take me home country road let's go not gonna maroon with the right mix that took me all the way to amazon where you farm deal Ooh. 
Oh. All right, let's move the time again. Here we go. So, here's the question though. Do we go back to like the very beginning where we were using this mix or do we keep trying the Gigantica mix? I will say when we started using the Gigantica mix, we like, like we broke all of our personal records like the first stream that we were trying it. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. Maybe we should just keep doing it. Let's keep trying it. We're going to get it. We better just stick to it. Better not experiment too much, huh? Goodness gracious. Oh, someone's coming down. Someone's coming down. Who do we got? Who's over there? <gasps> it's a little boy. What you doing, little boy? Huh? Oh my goodness. No one's seen a little boy in a long time. Hey, you come here. Hey, what do I got? Hey. <laughs> what are you doing? Huh? Did you come? Oh, oh, I love you, buddy. I do. Yeah. What'd you come down here for? Didn't you just come see me? Huh? <laughs> the darn thing is, my other dog, he, he doesn't care for cuddling whatsoever, but if you lay on the couch, like, this guy just comes over to you and just lays on top of you. He's such a cuddler. I love you. Okay. Lay you down. Ah. Bonk. What you- Oh! <laughs> no. No escaping. No escaping. Ah. Ah. God. <laughs> King Bjorn! How you doing, King Bjorn? Doing okay? Ah. <laughs> Did you follow him down, or what was your plan here? You show everyone your wonky ear? Yeah. You got a wonky ear now, don't you? You. <laughs> Alright, bye, buddy. Dog break. Dog break complete. Goodness gracious, my hair is cut. My hair. My desk is covered in hair now. My hair is covered in desks now. Back to it. Back to it. Okay. Hi. Are you here to help? Are we going to catch big fish now that you're here? I think so. Oh, what is the best casting method for the game? What now? What do you mean by that? As far as like cat, like a casting rod or a spinning rod, or what? What's what are you, what are you after? Or just like, like a retrieval method, I guess. Twitching, stop and go, that sort of jazz. Cat? No cat. Is St. Croix best to farm a level 30? I would certainly think so. That's why I put in my series 2 beginner, sirs. I don't mean to sound like a broken record. Because I don't like repeating myself. But. The entire reason for creating the series 2 beginner series. Was to put out a series of videos. That were made after I have already played through the game once. So I already knew everything. And so I tried to condense everything I knew into short episodes so that you can play along and learn and level up. So if you haven't watched all those episodes, 
then you probably come to the live stream and ask questions about it because you would know the answers to all the uh, questions if you just watched the series. I feel anyway. I don't know. Dwarfs, you're Boston. You have a whole Boston? They're squirrely little guys. <sighs> Update also allows to time skip while rods are in the... No way. You can, huh? Now that'd be pretty sweet. I didn't see that. Zatum? Zatum? I don't even know how to say it. What happened to the ear? So, yeah. So basically, one dog, little little dog, you know, the little boy bit the big boy's ear, and he got like a cauliflower ear. He got like this big lump of liquid in his ear, and so the um, we took him to the vet after after I had pierced it once and drained everything and then it just refilled and, and healed back with all the liquid back inside so we took him again the doctor gave him a bunch of pills and steroids and stuff basically to heal the ear and, uh, and drained it once more and then the ear you know never filled back up again but when it did heal it uh it like it's kind of like crinkled in one little spot where uh where it healed up from the wound so uh so he's got one wonky ear one straight ear <laughs> now <laughs> i think it makes him look tough come on he's a fighter obviously a fighter have i ever played five nights of freddy yeah we played it during uh halloween extravaganza one year Za, tum, big. Time movement is allowed now. Wow, very nice. Did I notice I don't mix as much cart mix anymore? It's half. Maybe. Yeah, I haven't. I haven't been paying attention. I haven't been paying attention. I bought hitchhike to Earth on the Apollo 8. Oh, did he? So now he's from outer space. He's like Hino now. Do you think there's a better bite rate if you set the hook while retrieving? I mean, yeah. I mean, like a twitch maneuver, right? You're you're retrieving it in. You're constantly twitching it by right clicking if you do that um or i guess it could be the other way too right you could be right clicking the entire time and then reeling in consistently um either way you are like right clicking to set the hook so as you're twitching and everything if a fish comes along it's basically like automatically hooked Santiago with the sub. Thank you. So you'll definitely have a better hookup rate anyway. I don't know if it like the bite rate technically improves. It's just gonna it's the bite rate is gonna improve for the fish that go for that retreat. You know. What fish do you suggest to go after your level 60? Hard to say, man. Hard to say. Though as said before, who was it that said it? Was it Dark Exile? The the carpet weeping willows are, are pretty good. Once you have a good good mix, it's hard to beat. I'm going all in. I'm throwing everything I got into this spot right now. We're we're calling in a big fish or we're not getting anything at all. Last throw, the last throw. Here we go. Okay. 
seventh cousin three times removed and transform into a robot body. Oh my. Oh my god. I don't like that talk. What's your favorite fish you have caught in real life? Ooh. I think I did it twice in a row. Um, hmm. You know, I, I'd still have to go with the alligator gar. It's just a heck of a fish. Goes after lures, goes after bait. Just a nice fish, and they're just huge. Every single one of them is huge. I really did enjoy going after the giant snakehead in Taiwan. They're a fun fish too. Um, but, but yeah, hard to beat the alligator gar. Just a fun fish. Think you finished the lore for now? For just for now. Ninety-four pound mirror carp. That's a good one. one that left one nudged a little bit <laughs> to get the elusive hundred pound car pay hey, very nice 94 is pretty darn close closer than me anyway Thank you, thank you. As a sentient bot. Uh, this guy doesn't look to be 100 pounds. The only fish around here is rainbow trout. My biggest is four pounds. Hey, right on, man. Bigger than my rainbow trout. You know, for not being 100 pounds, he's still putting up a decent little fight. Now we've got a second fish on. I'm afraid to leave it. Gosh dang, we got all three rods going off now. Timed one out. Get in the net, you. 76 pound leather. Switch rods, he nil. Switched over to the mirror, which is good. Technically, the other one could have been a mirror as well, though. blimp maybe this guy will break 80 it's putting up a decent little fight I mean he's going back and forth back into I'm just stuck at the Amazon stuck at the Amazon Amazon's not a bad place man you can uh you can farm arapaima and honestly you could farm electric eel and arapaima at the same location well he doesn't look like much but he sure is putting up a fight 81 pounds okay so we did kind of think he'd be over 80 pounds I'll give him a boogie Give him, give him a little bit of a boogie there.
anytime anytime it goes over 80 pounds not bad not bad oh my god don't want to be a uh, negative Nancy it's only 830 but it feels like so much later There's a boilie on the left side that's just moving. Is that the third one? It must be. Can I talk about the ocean update a little bit? I, I don't really have anything I can talk about. I've already said everything in the video. I mean, we can certainly talk about it, but I don't have anything else that I haven't already mentioned, I guess. Couldn't catch a single trophy shark. Was it nerf recently or something? It's impossible to catch on float and rare with Chad that I saw. You know, I haven't, I don't think I've ever caught a trophy carp or a trophy shark, to be quite honest. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Maybe they did make it harder, but I, I've never caught one. Ghost car, let's go. 66 pounder. <laughs> I don't know if that's truly something to like be super excited about, but it's new personal record, so we're gonna roll with it. We have that we can be happy about. I'm not sure if there's much else. We missed one of them, which was either common or grassy, it looks like at this point. We can wait a couple more minutes, but I'm not going to wait for around forever. If you can only catch one fish for the rest of your life, you can catch it whenever. It doesn't matter the time or weather or re season. You will only catch that fish. What would it be? Oh. <sighs> Hard to say, man. I'm a, I'm, I'm a man of... Uh, Variety. I like to have lots of different stuff. If you took if you took a look around my office and, and the surrounding area, you you'd see the various hobbies that I'm into. Specifically because I can't do the same thing for too long. I get too bored of it. Um Yeah, that's the reason why I I only play Fishing Planet during the live streams, it seems, these days. Just because I've played it for so long, I just don't find it that fun anymore. But so many people keep asking me questions about it and d videos and wanting to see it that I continue to play it, even though I, I really don't. You know, it's it, it was a fun game at one point, but I've already already played the whole thing, so I don't really enjoy it anymore. But I say that because it's hard to say like one fish, you know. And if I said a fish and it wasn't in my area, would that mean I just I never caught a fish at all, or it doesn't matter where I fish too? I just catch that fish. You're trying to watch this on all your devices? Oh my goodness. It's going to be a new PB grass car too. What's up? You're the best. You're the best, Rob. Sounds good. I was using the wrong pull for the Maui Buffalo. Didn't realize this one matters as long as the bait was on the bottom. 
Mm. Sadie Snail's in the house. How's it going, Sadie? One fish for the rest of your life. I know. I'd say the one biggest thing with that is that you can always vary your adventures. It's never the same person if you're always in experiencing new things together. Then you're just growing. You're changing. You're growing as a person every single day. 71 pounds. Yeah, boy. Walleye perch is enough. Well, we got another fish, but I can't imagine it's anything that great. A little common. This reminds me of that uh that giant brown trout we caught it wasn't even that big was it only like four pounds or something like that but it sure put up a decent fight in russian fishing for the other day does anyone remember that was anyone there for that where we cut we got like got a fish on and it like freaking tore off it was just like zzz, the line just continued to go off and we were like oh my god what did we get what did we get ended up being like a four pound brown trout which was like a new personal record for me that was crazy it was a good fight good fight it's a shame that more people don't play russian fishing for they need to get it out on console so that more people play it because that would be a fun game to continue playing what is going on here All right, so we're done with this, I guess. Oh, there's a fish down there. <laughs> ah, that's funny. Okay, so I guess we got to move on to another day now. Oh, the joys of chasing the 100-pound carp. Just going over and over again. Do I think I'll enjoy it again when the ocean updates release? Yeah, probably so. Something new to do. Something new to do. I do have big plans for this next year. Um, and I'm doing stuff right now to prepare for it, which is why I haven't been putting out any videos. And I've been working on the Taiwan video for the MDO. So if you are looking forward to a video releasing at some point, you better be following the MDO because that's where I'm going to have three videos coming out on that channel, probably before I put out another video on the BZ Hub. So better, better check it out. But otherwise, I've been working on a ton of stuff for, uh, for this next year because um, we're going to be doing some big changes on the channel. Looking forward to it. It's going to be sweet. Reload, please. Yes, thank you, Empty Spod. So confused right now. Do something, fishing planet. Do something. Is the net out for Xbox? I don't know. Did you go on Xbox and try to catch a fish? How would I know if something was out on net on Xbox? I don't play Xbox.
Do you often ask firefighters how the crime is in their town? Huh? Do you? Hey, policeman. How do you... How do you work a fire truck? I don't understand, you guys. We don't... It's not working. Classic fishing planet. Crashing and bugging again. I don't know what to do. I guess leave. We made a whole nother mix. And the spot's not working. dang thing <sighs> so sick of it <laughs> I just want the game to work Thanks, River Nelson. Appreciate it. Oh, it hurts inside. It hurts inside. Show us how to twitch. How to twitch. Just keep the rod tip up to speed and left click every so often. How do you set the casting distance? Sorry for the million stupid question. I, I, I don't know. I don't know what you mean by casting distance. Like, do you mean by like clipping the line or something like that? try this one more time one more time and that's it it was in the sky for the whole fight in the sky that does sound fun I guess the game's just broken. <sighs> I don't, I don't, what do you want to do? Wait, what, what do you want to do? Keep the invisible on. Are you the one that asked me about this the other day? I mean, I can't think of another reason to keep it. If you already caught the, the Mad-Eye Buffalo, there's really no reason to keep the invisible line anymore. Know what I mean? And there's not, nothing to catch with it. I don't know. There, Blue Crab isn't really a place you go to level up, Mom of God. So I'm sorry. Believe <laughs> A, hello. Just caught a 70 pound. 37 inches and two storms. Oh my goodness. I keep waiting for it, man. I know it's gonna it's gonna come in any day. Any day now, it's gonna start snowing on us. That's why we put out our Christmas lights already. I was like, if it starts snowing and getting icy and, and gross, like I don't want to be 
up on a ladder or up on a roof putting up Christmas lights so that's why last uh last weekend we just we went ahead and just put them all up backpack expansion available hot dog all right what do we got here we got that we got that we got that all right so number three is what we're probably gonna need what are you let's catch some muskies eh Wait, this is Fishing Planet? No, Fishing Planet was broken, so we moved on to another game. Ain't hitting like they used to, oh yeah? That's one thing I haven't done. I haven't gone after the sturgeon in quite a while. size of swim bait we're using right now Got him. Boy, it's a northern pike. How about that? Did they did they alter how many uh, muskies in northern pike there are? That was one of my last uh, one of my last things I said about the game. It, they put out a survey to the um, to like the uh, oh the inner circle of uh, of content creators that play this game. And one of the things I said was that uh, was that you catch muskies too often. It needs to be switched. You need to catch pike more often and, and catch a muskie every now and then. And uh, and maybe this catch, you know, is a, is a sign that maybe they did that. I don't know. We'll have to find out then. Saw fishing planet gameplay and it was in real life fishing. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Classic. Classic switcheroo. Trying to pull a fast one on you. know like with certain stuff like this because like this used to be a heck of a place to uh, fish you know and I never know if they like put out an update that made this location not as good anymore or if this is just a bad time to be fishing here like that's the part of the game that like I don't I don't understand very well breaks the immersion for me is trying to figure out if uh, if something's not working in a game because of an update or uh, or if it's a part of the game that I don't know about <laughs> oh, I, there's I see something over there This is looking a bit more like a musky. Silver musky, 11.54 pounds. Okay. Decent fish. And level 19. 
We got a code 19. Just wanted to say thank you for making that. Hey, right on, Kenzie. Glad to hear it. Ugh. Is that a, I, I, you're welcome. Thank you, thank you. What do you do with the unused feeder bait for car fishing? I wish there was a way to take all the leftovers and combine them together. Would be nice, right? Would be pretty cool. Just about ready to move on to another location if we don't catch another fish, but we got one. We got him. Not an old northern pike. Nice. Okay. Well, let's take a look around the dam here to see if there's anything just calling our name. Ooh, there's some bass down there. There is some bass down there. What do we got that we can use for bass? The spinner bait? like a little bluegill down here too i believe anyway well, that might be a perch oh let's see they're bluegill maybe it's a green sunfish blood worm you try that i think i have a blood worm on this one right now Zoom in. Uh, I don't remember how to zoom in. Oh, there we go. Not impressed with my blood worm. What if it? See, it's gotta be. It's gotta be a bluegill. Focus with F. He is just not interested in this blood worm whatsoever. He's just sitting there.
All right, size 10. Here we go. This is going to get him. Oh, he's coming. Get it, boy. Got him. Hooked up, boys. An absolute toad. Freaking 1.2 pound bluegill. We're killing it. Where is that spot? Where is that spot? It's over by the dam, man. Only There's only one dam here. way over here we in the same lobby oh yeah it's catching one fishing planet you're now 24 working on getting to 77 you're now level 20 24 working to get to 77 that is a heck of a uh change in level man There'd be bluegill over here for days. Ooh, there's a bigger fish swimming beyond them. River Nelson's out. See you later, River Nelson. Got ya. Yeah, I'm on the lookout for a bigger one, though game name this is uh called wild the angler of course come on it's only like three good fishing games out there this i mean it's not hard not hard to figure out what game we're playing swimming over there. change the title so what so that people click on this video in the future and don't click on to see the 100 pound carp we were going for it's not my fault that fishing planet broke and we couldn't continue going after the 100 pound carp You ever fish with fans if they are fairly close geographically? I mean, if they were, then yeah. Get a range, a range to go out. Usually if I find out that you're in the area, I'm all about it, but yet to find people willing to go. Definitely the way, hey, right on BSK family. Glad to hear it. Well, we caught a few bluegill, but nothing big. I was hoping maybe we'd like wander into a freaking sweet bluegill spot. Doesn't seem to be the case though. Got him. I saw him over there. I saw him. And I said, I want you. And now we have him. Got him. Another silver tiger muskie. These tiger muskies are not bad, man. I like it. 
I see you. I see you. All right, cool. I don't know where to go now. Usually my go-to for like uh, just finding something to fish for. What do we find? A half dollar? Heck yeah, we got half a dollar. What's up, Big Bjorn? What you doing there, pal? Gonna put a marker down for a silver, silver muskie. Got him. There's all sorts of fish down here, man. Look, look at them all. They're swimming all over the place. Okay. Well, I feel like we should go for something else that's not musky. Let's try... Let's try some fishing off a boat. Bro, what happened to Fishing Planet? Why are you not playing it? Do I have to com continue c just repeating myself? Goodness gracious. If you weren't here, then you have missed it. So sorry, buddy. No, oh, the game broke. It wasn't working anymore, so we quit. Stop. I don't want to. Oh, I'm getting games confused now. Deep. Hello, hello. Ever played catch carp, of course. I played, um. What was it? Fishing Simulator World Pro something or Pro Tour or whatever, which was like another version of that exact same game. But no, I never played the carp catching course or whatever. Catch the catch carping course. Whatever. Let's see what we can catch over here. I'm in Wisconsin right now. I thought everyone knew that. Come on. I don't know off the top of my head, Jake. Sounds good, Sander. We were already fishing together, Felipe. I was fishing. You could have been fishing instead of jumping around. We were fishing together. gracious I wonder what the heck was going on Woo! doing some freaking air dynamics nice little brook sweet pretty fish all right what was jumping over here thanks crazy there you are. There you are. But they're all over the place over here. I see one chasing it. Got him. Hooked up, boyos. Is it cutthroat? No, it's not a brook trout, I think. All right, I think we could maybe go down a hook size. Maybe. 
using a six, now we're using a five. Cheese Ed. Well, I'm from Kansas City. So we just moved here about I don't even know what it is now. Eight months ago. So I'm not a cheese head. I see a fish coming after it. He's following it. Get it, bud. Catch up with it. I'm going to slow it down. Get it. He's got it. <laughs> oh, God. That was humorous. That is super small rainbow. Now the subtitles are not, nothing's working. Everything's breaking. Israel, how's it going? Howdy, howdy. fish over here but they might just be really small unless the game crashes on us or everything crashes on us oh good golly Nothing's working today. <laughs> Is this a sign? like a good deal what's up Seth McDonald happy to present an update that is certain to add fun to your gaming experience club leagues start December 1st boat competitions designed for various windows and tabs and we can buy this We can buy the golden pack. Holy crap, the golden pack is expensive. It's $50. That's crazy. Digging the Christmas tunes. It kind of just started like the the guy that we're playing music from. He He has a few Christmas songs.
Are you working yet? Spod. Hey, it's working. Let's go. Let's go. We could just pick up where we left off. Oh, thanks, Seth. Appreciate it. Don't tell anyone, but you're my favorite viewer. I decided this long ago. There's an audio issue now. How's it going, Legendary Indy? I evidently need to say something so I can see what you're talking about. I got, I got nothing. Everything's working good. just started playing this game right on and what do you think what do you think so far <sighs> um, getting tired getting tired looks like we're gonna be able to get one more round of this in wouldn't it be crazy if after everything we've been through today this is when we get the hundred pound carp after after trying like two or three times the game glitching out switching the call of the wild the angler it glitching out and then we come back to fishing planet on a whim and find out like that is when we catch the hundred pounder it'd be wild it'd be cool Really good. Hey, right on. Buzzbait. Surface runs right. You know, I have a video about that. We have a video on how to use buzzbaits correctly. Honestly, what you should know about the buzzbait is that it is like the best lure. It's one of the best lures in the game. The audio is cutting out. I don't, guys, I, it's bad because I like, I can't. Every time I every time I try to check out the live stream on my phone, it's going good. At the same time, YouTube up here says that it's not receiving enough video to maintain smooth streaming, which is weird because my streaming software says that it's green and good to go, and it's doing a good job and keeping high high uh, refresh or whatever. 
like the rate that it's sending information. So something I, I don't really know. Everything on my end, except for YouTube, saying that there's something going on. Every time I check it on my phone to hear what the stream's going, because you keep saying that the audio is cutting out or whatever, like everything that I'm seeing says it should be good. Perfectly fine. Okay, good. I'm very confused. I don't like there's nothing that I can tell that's not working. Now we have only 12 minutes. Good to hear, fishing gamer. Okie dokie. Here we go. This is our chance. Make a beginner's video, please. We have a bunch of beginner's videos. You you should feel so lucky. We have so many beginner's videos you don't even know. If you're looking for a beginner's video, you came to the right place. And not only do I have one, but I have so many. Do I still play RF4? Yeah, we played it the other day during live stream. Where were you, Martin? What was the latest fishing plan update? I don't know. Did you check the notes? Bunch of stuff. Bunch of stuff in it. Didn't seem like anything that important. I'm sorry. I've already answered the question though, and I don't feel like answering it. <laughs> it's nothing that great. How about that? Is that good enough? Seems like a decent sized grass carp though. Get in there. 66 pounder, heck yeah. Running smoothly, good deal. Felipe, best fishing gamer ever. I hope at the start of the year we can we can solidify that in stone. It's gonna be it's gonna be widely known. I got plans. I got big plans for next year. It'll probably mean less videos, but the videos will be fun. I'm looking forward to it a lot. <sighs> And I have one really cool game for gaming month. I'm excited about it. I saw that Seth right on. Here we go. Ooh, 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 okay. Dude, that's a Mondo. the chat showing up on the right side it's annoying
You have all your information on the right side for reeling in a fish, and then the text shows up on the right side as well. Why? Why? Covers up all your stuff. Come here, you. Goodness gracious, second wind here. Finally get him close and then he decides to go off far again. Get him through the weeds here. Get in there. 88 pounds. God, man. Oh. I knew he was pretty big when we saw him in the water, but gosh darn. I was hoping. I was hoping he was bigger. It's okay, though. This is a ghost or a common. He's tearing offline. Goodness gracious. I love you, but not in a weird way. Oh, thank you. I I I, I like being loved in a not in a you know a not weird way. That's that's the best. <laughs> This dude, this is a pretty decent sized uh, common, honestly. Good, good freaking size. Come on, you. There we go. Ah, I freaking knew it, dude. That's awesome. Oh, shoot. 73 pounder. Gosh dang it. He now. I was freaking hitting the button for you to switch to the other rod for like three times there, bud. God, that's annoying. Goodness. Well, not much more we can do. I guess we'll just throw it back out there. We got four minutes. We can wait and see if we get anything else. That was the leather, though. So I'm not sure if we'll be back. Can I get the 100 for the life of you? No. 98's pretty freaking good, though. That's awesome. You're 10. Ooh. I remember being 10. Can you explain the update? It's nothing big. Don't worry about it. If you want to know more, go to the Facebook or whatever and read everything. Well, we lost the leather and then we immediately got a leather again. Is he a trophy? Oh, how about that? 54 pounder. If I was smart, I probably would have just ended it right there. When are we going to get the ocean update? When I mentioned it in the video. Do you remember the release date? The release date that we mentioned in the video? A.
There you go. Ohio Brez got it. They've got it. A plus, A plus to Ohio Brez. I've gone into relaxation mode. I have to zoom in. I got so much work to do. All I can think about is going to bed. But I can wake up and do more work. <laughs> You don't think you've missed one? Oh my goodness. Well, right on. That's awesome. There's probably some bad ones in there, don't you think? Or quite a few bad one, bad episodes in between. Get a carpon. Like a tarpon, but a carpon. Certainly getting bites. I'm not sure we'll get another one. Like some smaller ones? You think some of the smaller episodes aren't good? That's funny. I'm honestly still amazed how many people watch the live streams after they've happened. That always surprises me. Get in there. Top notch. Well, I tell you what, everybody. I know it's not a monster to end it on, but it is 930. I'm glad everyone was here for a fun day Monday live stream with everybody. I enjoyed it. Mostly pretty helpful and entertaining. Oh, well, good. Anywho, glad to be back in Weeping Wells. Wednesday, I hope that we're able to do something, but honestly, the live stream might get canceled. We'll just have to see. We have a... Uh, we have a pretty big project that's due on Wednesday. So work might make me uh, work a little late on Wednesday. We'll just have to find out. I enjoy it. Derek Malovich enjoyed it. If Derek Malovich en enjoyed it, then that's all that matters to me. <laughs> all right. Well, take care, everyone. Glad you were here. Uh, yep. Like, subscribe, all that jazz. We'll see you uh, maybe on Wednesday. If not, maybe Monday. We'll just have to see. Sadie Snail, have a good night. You as well. Everyone have a good night. Lacey, Ohio, bruh. Seth McDonald, the 10 year old. Take care, everybody. Planet, one family, game on.